Hello everyone, this is Fawad. Welcome back to X4 Fiber testing series. So this is my X4 tester. I just take the remote session of my X4 tester through the LAN cable. So I just launched this application mini toolbox. Need to start next tester. So it will take a couple of seconds. So meanwhile, I'll show you our required so this is our requirement. The first requirement is we need to test our fiber cable through RFC 2544 with frame rate 9600 and we need to test latency plus we can add throughput. And that need to be stored in <coughs> order to in millisecond and the setting is for frame rate 9600 and bandwidth utilization should be 100 percent so let's start with rsc 2544 so just click on it as i showed in the previous video i loop fiber cable on sfp port 2 so we will select that one first First of all, you need to modify structure. Select the interface. I am going to select 10 G LAN where and the port number two where I have looped my fiber cable. Just click on LAN setting. <coughs> These are the default values. As you can see, the laser light is on. Make sure it should be on, otherwise, you will not get the proper values here. So, if it is off, everything goes off, right? So, make sure that laser should be on. You can see the red circle. Now. And in the network side, as we are going to test on the uh, layer 2 connection, no need to set the IP addresses and this is the sfp info so minimize it and i'm not going to change it as we are only going to test the l2 connectivity so here we need to test throughput and latency and the frame size as as per our requirement we need to test with 9600 so just select user defined and quantity only one if you if you wanted to test with all the frame rate that's your choice otherwise we will stick with our requirement so once it is done then click on stop so it will be completed within one minute so if you wanted to get the values in megabit per second you can leave it as it is else you can go with gigabit option as well so the traffic you can see here in the traffic portion these are the unicast packet and as we have selected 9600 so the value should be reflect here and this is our graph as we are testing 10g interfaces so that's why it is showing here and this is our latency portion we can observe if is there any error it will reflect here so our test is completed let's save it and generate a report so here you need to specify your ticket number or job ID like future on cloud and just specify the file name date time then Six 
600 then we can specify port number that's it then this is for sake of argument and save report we need to specify the power bit so i prefer to go with pdf there is xml as well So once the report is saved, it will open automatically. So as you can see, the result is passed. And job ID, you can specify further detail here based on the circuit. So throughput completed in 30 seconds, then latency completed in 24 seconds. So verdict is pass. This is the start time. Throughput and lat latency both are passed. Throughput is 9.97 GB. You can see the value is GBPS per second. And this is the latency in milli. And then there are several options. So, so whenever you face any issue or any problem, you will see here if 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 you are going to test with uh, layer 3 and layer 4 then you can see the count here as well as it is only for L2 so that's why these fields are blank this is our interface option we have tested 10G LAN SAP plus and it is connected on port number 2 source and destination is same here because we are not testing on L3 what else is useful yes throughput throughput is 9.97 gb ps per second with frame rate 9600 this is our latency <coughs> it is reflecting in the chart as well so um, now we will proceed further with our next task which is we need to test to the bird bit error weight testing I believe so just close it and let's move forward with just click on setup and minimize it go to application and select select layer 2 and the pattern should be pattern can be written in this format or in this format it depend upon which kind of tester you are using so the frame size is 1518 and bandwidth is 100% 100% we need to utilize First of all, modify the structure. Select NG LAN. This port is already selected. Port number 2. And framing is layer 2. So NG LAN SFP port 2. You need to select the port where your cable is connected to and the frame rate. Then Etherbird, click on it and this is the pattern which we need to select there are multiple patterns so based on requirement you can select appropriate pattern and the bit rate frame rate should be 1518 and 100% we need to change so if you wanted to specify a time you can specify a time from here so like like custom duration and from here you can specify for how long you wanted to run this test so let's say I wanted to run this test for um, need to run this test for one minute okay and 
should be fixed if there are multiple so you can select but if you wanted to go with the least frame rate then node option is use the fixed one now click on start so here the timer is started so let's wait for one minute Let's look at our requirement. We are testing layer 2 using bird test bird setting and our pattern is PRVS31 and the frame size is 1518 byte and bandwidth utilization is 100 percent So as, as you can see here in one minute it is completed and now let's save this report. name my road 20 and save report so as you can see again it is passed this is start time duration is one minute verdict is passed total frame sent and receive port number 2 10G LAN this is our bitrate and our frame size SFP info and the result is passed. So, this is it for now. Thanks for watching.